This video is intended to train healthcare professionals how to use the BioLine HCV test kit. These components are included in the test kit. These components are required but not provided. Here are some important notes before you begin. Check the expiration date. Put on disposable gloves. Open the test pouch and place the device on a flat and dry surface. Write the patient's identification on the device. Clean the patient's fingertip using an alcohol swab and allow it to air dry. Open the lancet and prick the patient's finger. Insert the protective cap and immediately discard the used lancet in the biohazard box. Wipe away the first drop of blood with the sterile gauze. Gently squeeze the finger and allow a drop of blood out of the finger. The amount of collected blood is critical. Make sure to collect 10 microliters up to the fill line. Squeeze the top of the capillary pipette and bring the open tip to the blood. Slowly release the pressure to collect the drop of blood up to the marked fill line. Squeeze the capillary pipette again. Dispense all the whole blood into the round specimen well on the device. Keep squeezing the capillary pipette while moving it away to avoid back suction. Immediately discard the used capillary pipette in the biohazard box. Hold the diluent bottle vertically and add four drops of assay diluent into the specimen well. Wait for the colored lines to appear. Read the results between 5 to 20 minutes. The test line T is specific for HCV and C is the control line. Please note that visible test lines should be considered reactive, even if faint. Only one line in the control line C means it is non-reactive. A line in C and a line in T means a reactive result for HCV. If no line appears in the control line C, it means the test is invalid. Repeat the test again with a new test device.